Bevel State Community College has four main campuses and one instructional site. Serving over one quarter million people in a seven county area with a service area that spans over 4,600 square miles from the Birmingham city limits to the Mississippi state line. The college has opportunities for academic transfer, health sciences, career technical education, dual enrollment, workforce solutions, adult education. Bevel State Community College is strategically committed to a mission. I'm Dr. Joel Haygood, President of Bevel State Community College. Okay, our mission at Bevel State is that we are dedicated to student success by providing quality educational and training opportunities that enriches lives intellectually, economically, and culturally. Our vision at Bevel State is to always be striving for excellence for education, workforce training, partnerships, and economic development. We collaboratively with our stakeholders and our college community put together our strategic plan and we, we focused on the KISS approach, keep it super simple. And we narrowed that down basically to three, three main topics, connect, complete, and contribute. Connect is simply collaborating with our stakeholders from our college community uh, through activities, uh, partnerships, and initiatives, which essentially that led to scholarships, capital contributions, and athletic contributions. Um, and all that combined has led to our increase in our enrollment, um, especially coming out of the pandemic year. We've seen steady increases. I think a lot of that has to do with our connect piece and, and the collaboration among the stakeholders in our community. We've seen almost a 2,000 credit hour increase in dual enrollment, and that's largely due to our community partners, like the Walker Area Community Foundation with the Don Drummond Family Fund, uh, the City of Jasper, contributing $100,000 to career tech educational opportunities, uh, the Pickens County Foundation, and then also the Bevel Foundation in the FET community. Another joint effort with Bevel State Community College is the Don Drummond Family Fund Dual Enrollment Scholarships that is sending every year students through, especially those that are looking for technical education certification and moving on with their life as part of the workforce in Walker County. We've been partners with Bevel for decades and we're proud to be working with them. We're especially proud as Bevel begins to express itself more and more off campus and in the community as part of the new and improved Walker County. My name is Sean McDaniel. I am the College and Career Center uh, Principal and Career Tech Director for Pickens County. Uh, I am blessed to be a part of the Pickens County College and Career Center. It was in 2015 that we began working to birth the vision um, of the opportunity to expand dual enrollment. The Pickens County College and Career Center has always, uh, Pickens County School District has always been a part of, of dual enrollment with Bevel State through just the history course uh, 201 and 202. But we began to recognize the need of um, expanding from a career tech standpoint and so we began to partner with Bevel State and we learned that high wage and high demand was very critical in determining these programs and where students could receive jobs. And so with a long-standing relationship with Bevel State Community College, and we sat down and um, it was a, a, a great opportunity and collaboration to, to not just throw money at dual enrollment, but to write a pathway and develop a product. And so we looked at our entire uh, programs across the board and we uh, then began to determine we needed more money. And so from there, we developed what was called the Pickens County College and Career Center Scholarship Foundation in hopes that business and industry would contribute in which they have uh, to provide us with an opportunity to fund those classes through Bevel State. 
So we begin to open those pathways and fund those programs for our students here in Pickens County and parents begin to, uh, to buy in. With our partnership with Bevel State, the buy-in began to take place. Our scholarship foundation began to receive money from various organizations uh, throughout West Alabama. And then our students began to uh, sign up and uh, parents began to understand this dual enrollment process that their child could get college credit, high school credit at the same time, and also be able to earn an associate's degree or certificates, um, depending, and credentials um, through the Pickens County College Career Center and through Bevel State Community College. And today, um, now here on the campus at Pickens County College and Career Center, um, we offer right at uh, dual enrollment program classes. We have um, a 60 hour program for industrial maintenance. We have computer science, which is now six certificates and our associate's degree program. Um, we offer, uh, most students leave us with around 40 to 42 academic hours plus the uh, associate degree pathway hours um, in the career technical field, which is an amazing opportunity. It takes kids out of poverty, uh, it takes students out of poverty, it gives them hope and an opportunity to, to find success. Um, it gives them the opportunity to achieve their educational goals, whether it be at the associate degree, bachelor's degree, and future to the master's degree. Also gives them opportunity to make money um, and to provide uh, for their families and to give them an opportunity to create success. We also have our STEM 22 partnership, which is a true community collaborative effort between Alabama Power, the Walker Area Community Foundation, our K-12 partners, the Jasper City School System, and the Walker County School System, along with Bevel State. And the idea is to provide a seamless transition as students progress along from middle school to high school, culminating in a career pathway uh, in the STEM field here at Bevel State Community College. The STEM 22 grant it is a really interesting partnership from the grantor side because it is the Walker Area Community Foundation and the Alabama Power Company. But on the other side, it's Bevel State Community College coordinating with the Walker County School System and the Jasper City School System. And our ultimate goal there is to really get the STEM introduction to the students as early as possible, hopefully around grades four, five, and six. Complete is simply uh, empowering our students, both credit and non-credit, through programs and services to see them through completion, through their educational goals or whatever their career pathways may be. This past year, each year we uh, seem to turn out more uh, associate's degrees. This past year we had 14 industrial maintenance associate's degrees. We had over 30 some students earning within uh, three credentials in welding, pipe fitting, opportunities available and then we have of course over the the amount of, of some 42 academic hours that are prepared to transfer to college. This allowed these students to immediately enter the workforce in a high wage, high demand field. At, at Bevel State we're emphasizing rapid training opportunities through our workforce solutions division and creating clear pathways that get students into the workforce quickly through both long-term and short-term certifications. Contribute is exactly what it says. It's uh, us contributing to our community and providing a skilled workforce uh, and an educated citizen base. A key element of our Contribute piece is apprenticeships. And we are proud of our machine tool technology apprenticeship, which was the first competency-based apprenticeship in the state of Alabama in machine tool technology. My name is Marie Single. I am the Director of Career Technical Education here at Bevel State. I'm not only an employee, but I am a former student. Um, I went through a career tech program. I worked in the field uh, for several years, but I started working in the field when I was still a student. So given the opportunity for students to work while they're taking classes is very beneficial. And I understand that completely because I know the benefit that it was for, for me. Um, I came to Bevel as an instructor. I was an instructor for 17 years, 17, 18 years in a career tech field. And I know what it is, the hard work for someone to work and go to school. I also know how rewarding it is when they get that first job and, um, and see the look on their faces and 
that, that is, brings excitement to me just as if it were me getting a job. Here at Bevel State, we have several registered apprenticeships through the Alabama Office of Apprenticeship. Our first one uh, to register was welding. And then now we have HVAC service, which is heating, air conditioning, and refrigeration. And one of our most recent is our machine tool. Um, I'm, I'm happy to say that Bevel State's machine tool apprenticeship is the first in the state to be competency-based. So uh, we are now signing on industry to um, employ students as apprentices. We also have several uh, companies that are working under a non-registered apprenticeship. They are employing students uh, to work around their schedule and paying them, uh, and so they're learning while they're on the job and while they're in the classroom. And this is a great benefit for the students because they're learning in two different aspects, two different ways. It's also a benefit for the industry because they can see how the employee is working. One of the benefits of students dual enrolling while they are in high school into our programs is as soon as they graduate high school that they're able to interview for an apprenticeship position. And this will allow them to go to work as soon as they graduate high school and continue to complete the program. So it's a great benefit for them to be already a Bevel student and then complete at least two years under um, the umbrella of dual enrollment and then be able to move straight into an apprenticeship program. The FET Community Foundation, the Bevel Foundation, and the Beauvais Foundation uh, which provides multiple scholarships to the students that, that attend the FET campus. Also here in Walker County, we have the uh, Walker Area Community Foundation and the Walker College Foundation. And then also our municipalities uh, in making their contribution. Uh, the City of Jasper in helping us to improve and renovate athletic facilities. Uh, the City of Summerton doing the same with our, with our softball complex. Uh, the, the list goes on and on. Of, of how our, our community partners have come together with the college to, uh, to make our facilities more appealing and to provide opportunities for the students in our service area. Another partnership that we're proud of is the Walker County Arts Alliance, which is now located here on our campus to provide a culturally enriching experience for our students through the arts. President Haygood, the faculty and staff here at Bevel State love establishing relationships inside this community and want to see it change and grow for the better. I often tell our folks and our community partners that we are your community college.